Welcome back. It's time now for our Friday look at sports. Uh, in this edition of the Sunny Side of Sports, Shani Yang profiles a power lifter from Ghana who will be competing at this year's Paralympics in London. Sporty greetings once again to all our In Focus viewers. In this segment, we profile Charles Tay, a power lifter and double amputee from Ghana who is going to London in August to compete at the Paralympics for disabled athletes. My hopes for the Olympics uh, is very great. Charles says he has great hopes of winning a medal in the bench press in the 67.5 kilogram weight class. He says he was just an infant when he lost both his legs because of an infection. In the twinkle of an eye, they realized that the whole legs become black and then spotted. So they quickly rushed me to the hospital. Uh, I was there for three days and then the leg started flowing water. It looks like uh, when you pour hot oil on you, you know, it swallows and then start flowing water. So in about two to three weeks, they realized the um, leg was coming off. Charles credits a radio broadcast with helping develop his interest in powerlifting. He says he heard an announcement about sports opportunities for disabled athletes. So when I go to the sports stadium, we were interviewed, they asked me, what can I do as I can play table tennis? And then they said, oh, you have a very good physique, your shoulders are broad, why don't you do a sports called powerlifting? I said, what is powerlifting? And then they uh, took me through the process and I said, oh, I do bench press at the back of uh, a friend's yard in a home, so I can do it. Ready, let's go. Charles also credits the Right to Dream charity with helping improve his training through sponsorship, better diet, and professional coaching. <sighs> he won a gold medal earlier this year at a competition in Wales and qualified for the Paralympics, which begin August 29th, two weeks after the Olympics end in London. Charles says he hopes to use the platform of the Paralympics to raise awareness about disabled sports. Then I'll be proud because they uh, mostly give uh, small attention to disabled sports. And as of now, as I'm speaking, as of now, I don't even know if some of the able bodies have even qualified. I've not even heard anything. So then Ghana should be proud that uh, in the Olympic Games coming on in London, they had the first slot, which everybody can boast of that Ghana would definitely be there and a Ghana flag would definitely be raised. Power lifter Charles Tay, who will be waving Ghana's flag high at the Paralympics in London. I'm VOA Sonny Young, and that's the sunny side of sports.